Nutrition Innovation has now developed NXP, a super concentration and unique source of polyphenols upcycled grade from the sugar cane plant. Those polyphenols can have antifungal, antibacterial, antiviral, anti-diabetic benefits. Matthew Godfrey, CEO of Nutrition Innovation, will be joining us online from Singapore to present his company as part of this Givaudan Innovation Challenge. Thank you, Alex. Exactly four years ago today, we were in San Francisco launching new cane logi technology to the world. Now, happy to say it's a global presence and our partners have sold over 15 million kilograms around the world. Because we have created affordable, global, healthier choices, we have been awarded by the United Nations as one of the top 50 businesses in the world driving food change. Today, we are going to talk about the connection between immunity and our latest breakthrough, a unique and powerful polyphenol powder called NXP. The $1.2 billion polyphenol market is undergoing an exciting revolution. In the last few years, there's been an explosion of data strongly correlating polyphenols with a range of immunity benefits such as antiviral, anti-inflammatory, antibacterial, anti-diabetic, and making a positive impact on the microbiome. There are over 6,400 different types of plant polyphenols. But independent clinical science is now identifying the key polyphenols that have both powerful and broad immunity benefits. Specifically, the flavonoids, tricin, apigenin, and lutein. Incredibly, in the last few months, lutein and apigenin have been shown to even have the potential to inhibit the COVID-19 virus by blocking spike proteins. Additionally, polyphenols are liberated from the Arabia's island chain by the microbiome and then complexed up as bioactive short-chain fatty acids and shut around the body to play a role in both pre- and postbiotic health. The challenge for the food industry is that although polyphenols are widespread in fruit and berries, obtaining them can often be expensive, hard to scale, involve extraction solvents and in the process decomplex the compounds, which may cause complications such as chelation. These challenges often slow the widespread adoption of polyphenols into food systems. NXP solves these challenges because it is a super concentrated source of polyphenols upcycled from the waste streams of the sugarcane industry. Not only does it contain a rich source of bioactive immunity boosting compounds at almost 25 times the concentration of green tea powders, but it is naturally complex with micronutrients. And even though it comes from sugarcane, it is virtually sugar-free. It's all natural, hugely scalable, and therefore a breakthrough in affordable immunity boosting. We have two patents that support the IP behind NXP, and it is already in commercial production. But why source NXP from sugarcane in the first place? Firstly, these important immunity boosting compounds are discarded daily by the largest crop in the world, the global sugarcane industry. These waste streams are therefore highly affordable and endlessly scalable. As a gift from nature, the key immunity polyphenols of apigenin, lutein, and tricin are abundant in sugarcane. And critically, NXP is concentration technology, which means no solvents, no extraction, and the product is naturally complex. As mentioned, we have already reached food grade production scale and have successfully delivered customer orders. We've had requests from Europe, Australia, China, Singapore, and Thailand. But of course, we want to scale further to increase volume, not just for the food industry, but to use NXP as an anti-diabetic supplement, where just one kilogram of NXP can make up to 2,000 anti-diabetic tablets. We therefore believe NXP significantly delivers on the Givadan challenge to find natural breakthroughs in immunity boosting. The polyphenols in NXP boost immunity and impact the microbiome. It is upcycled from the world's largest crop, it's allergen and GMO free, no solvents or extractions, it's commercially available and affordable, it's already been used in food ingredients, and NXP has strong IP protection. 
In terms of collaboration, there are opportunities to expand NXP further in food systems through both characterization of the flavonoids and sensory optimization in foods. From an investment and commercial perspective, our business model is licensing. So there are opportunities for food and ingredient companies to take commercial advantage by licensing NXP in their category or geography. Plus, we are interested to receive inquiries from companies who want to invest in the future of immunity to help us both scale, monetize, and profit from the NXP breakthrough. It's been an honor to present here today at Future Food Tech San Francisco, and everybody at Nutrition Innovation would like to thank Gia Vidam for the opportunity to present our latest breakthrough NXP to the world. Thank you. Thank you, Matthew. Very interesting technology.